In this tutorial, uh, we'll be talking about the section views in SolidWorks drawing. So you can pretty much create a section view in a drawing by cutting the parent view with a cutting or section line. So what I mean is if I go to make drawing for part, I have the simple part which I have been using for all of the tutorials. And let's grab the top view. Okay. And uh, what section view uh, offers you is you can create a cutting or section line on this view which is my parent view and then you can create a section from this parent view right so to uh, do the section view you have uh, uh, the section view option inside view layout or else you can go to insert drawing view and select the section otherwise fine let's go for section view and once you select it you'll get four options for the cutting line so section view only works with the cutting line and uh, we have four different options first one is vertical horizontal is auxiliary and aligned so vertical and horizontal as the name suggests works in the similar fashion horizontal cutting line works horizontally while the vertical cutting line works vertical this auxiliary you can see it works at an angle and the fourth one which is aligned is also based on an angle uh, cutting line but this angle you can pretty much change all right so let's uh, for our parent model i think horizontal line will be the best to give this a section view and to do this once you, once you select the horizontal cutting line then select the midpoint and then we'll be getting this option which is basically uh, offsets so we have three different offsets we can create arc offset single offset or notch offset so these are basically the manual sketch entities you can manually create a uh, arcs and lines and then you can utilize all these three options but uh, for now we'll be using the uh, rather standard option so i'll press the green tick and then i'll get a section view i'll drag this up and we have our section view a few things that i want to mention in this one is you are seeing all these dimensions because i have checked in uh, my hmm, section view that uh, import annotation from the front so whatever front whatever the dimension or annotation are there in my parent uh, view it will be imported in the section view also all right other things that we can do in uh, section view is we can uh, change the direction of the cutting line so you can reverse it and you can see how the model flips you can change the label or you can say the name of the section this is section aa you can change it to any name you want to we have uh, furthermore options to uh, change the section view partial section slice section auto hatching scale hatch pattern and emphasize outline we have also option to change the section depth so if you check this section depth you'll get this pink line with the arrow and you can pretty much let's say i want it up to here and press the green tick to see how this part of the view goes off i don't want that so let's change section depth back to the normal All right don't want it okay so the other things are pretty much usual which you can uh, either import annotation it's up to you and change the display style you can scale if you want to so let's say i want to scale it to this to two okay so now when you scale your uh, section view it will be uh, will be inserted in forms of uh, the notation which says scale 1 is to 2 
so it already mentions the scaling if in case you do that also you can pretty much do the usual stuff that you get inside solidworks drawing all right so let's talk about uh, another option that we have in section view is you can pretty much hide the cutting line so according to the international drawing standards cutting line which is basically this one is not always required for section view so you can pretty much hide it and to do that click on your section view right click and say hide cutting line it's, it's more convenient now and more it's looking more organized you can also get back the cutting line by right clicking on the view and say show cutting line that's how you can uh, hide and show your cutting line and let's let's do another section view and this time we'll go for align section view and uh, zoom in to my section view i'm gonna start from the center of the hole over here and let's say i want it at an angle so I'll just start from here and ends up to here okay so you can drag this to this side and we have our aligned section view for the section view and this one is named section bb with a scale 1 is to 2 because the scaling of this section view is 1 is to 2 you can pretty much do the usual stuff that we did earlier change the flip direction change the label uh, change the display style custom scale all those different usual stuff you can also hide this cutting line and pretty much uh, the difference between uh, aligned section view and the regular horizontal or vertical section view is the vertical section view is basically works at an 180 degree similar to horizontal section view while in aligned section view you can pretty much um, change the angle to your uh, desire and then um, get the uh, required view so yeah that's it for this tutorial i hope you guys like it and in case if you have any doubts with this one feel free to comment down below i'll see you guys in the next tutorial peace out